Welcome to one of the biggest, bestest parks in Bathurst. If you've been here before, you've probably seen it, but not like this. Let's bear in mind as we have a look around that this park is maybe more nudist friendly than the previous park. There's hedges, there's sections of people playing frisbee. If that's not a requirement of a good park, I don't know what is. Still in Makati Park, we have the view. We have swans. Who, who doesn't love a swan? Which brings us to the deciding factor. Mm. Let's, let's decide with ducks in the background. How good is this park for parkly goodness? I'm, I'm going to go with what I said earlier and say 10 out of 10 for parkiness. I'm going to agree. I think, I think 10 is a respectable number. Very parky. This is a cute pigeon. Sorry, you can't see it. Um, Amenities. 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 Anonymities. Anonymities. And of course, um, facilities and utilities. So you have a grandstand, you have benches, toilets, you have toilets, you have bins. bins, lots of bins. You have geese and pigeons. Yeah. They eat crumbs, which is good because mm -hmm. who likes crumbs? Yeah. Not me. No. Crusts. Some awesome. people don't like crusts, so no, crusts as crust. well. Yeah. That pigeon Great. is mating with the other pigeon. So it's, it's a romantic it's atmosphere. Like, What's up, bitch? To cut this short, I'm going to give it a 9 for its amenities and facilities. Uh, I'm going to give it a 10. A 10? Yeah. It's a 9.5. So nine, nine Which brings us to really well the randomizing five. factor, the great equalizer. I want to know out of 10, how good would it be? Bear with me here. How good would it be in a game of Monopoly? How good is this land here? In a, in a, in a, in a, like if it was a if spot it was a on tile, the board, yeah. Um, I would I would pay good money for this place. You would pay good money place, yeah. in a game in a in yeah. monopoly. Would you put a hotel here? Do you think it'd be worth a lot? A hotel? I think so. I think I would really like to come out of a hotel and into this park. I think yeah, you know, a hotel situated in this park would actually be pretty. So pretty pricey, actually, I'm so going to be yeah. honest. I'm going to give it. I'm going to give it a, 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 a nine. Yeah, me too. Nine. Yeah. So that's nine, nine, and nine and a half? Yeah. No, no, ten. Ten. Ten, nine and a half, and nine? Yeah. You can figure that out at your own viewers because I'm confused. <laughs> Hello, boys and girls. We've taken a short break, and now it's getting quite late, so the light may have changed. We are here now at the Information Bay Park, off the highway, between a river and a prison. Because, I mean, let's face it, between a river need to watch children playing too. And a prison. Yay! Whee! <laughs> Yeah, definitely got stuck halfway. You <laughs> 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 must just keep my feet off the ground. <laughs> Tamara is bog. Tamara is bog. That says bog, right? Yeah. Tamara is bog. Tamara is bog. <laughs> Parkly goodness. I've gotta say, I can't really get over the whole across from the prison thing. Uh, okay. So I think um, that takes significantly away four. from Parkley goodness. So I, yeah, I'm gonna go four. 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 Amenity, amenities. Amenities. I can't even tell where the entry to those toilets is. So I, I don't even know, know if there is an toilets. entry. It used it to be. It might be a maintenance shed or something. No, a long, long time ago in a galaxy well, far away. It was. It doesn't toilets. seem to be easily accessible. So okay. I'm gonna mark some points off for that. But they do have a food serving area, and there is a bin, even four. though it's obviously not being used. Four. I'm gonna go five. Five. So four and a half and four are our two scores so no. far. Yes. Yeah, right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the final criteria we're gonna be judging this place on. So eight and a half so far. And now we have Could we raise a pet dinosaur here? Personally wouldn't raise a pet dinosaur across from a prison. But saying, and it's, not, and it's not contained at all. There's might no fences. Might keep the prisoners in line. Um, and, uh, I'm gonna say no. 
this, this a river? I'm going to say no. It's not a yes or no. It's a score between How, one uh, and four. <laughs> right. One and uh-huh. ten. One and ten. Okay. Um, I'd I'd say a, a, a two for dinosaur raising ability here. Okay. Not right. not too So good. we're going to balance it through. Okay. So, yeah. Eight and a half plus three. Eleven, 11 and, and a half, half out of for 30. Hector Park. Not a good day so for, good. for the crims. Oh well. Another park bites the dust. Another park bites the dust. Another park bites the dust. Boys and girls, to the Bathurst 1000 Great Race Playground at the top of Mount Panorama. From up here, there's some pretty nice views. The ground is a bit damp, the ground is a bit muddy. As you can see, that hasn't stopped the races along the little path. Yeah. Not moving very much, though. <laughs> so, as far as parking goodness goes, how are we feeling, Penny? I'm feeling... It's fenced in, you could raise a dinosaur here. You absolutely could, yes. This would be a good dinosaur raising like area. Through the cage. <laughs> <laughs> Have a rampage, but only on but the then, Panorama. But then, then, Rowan of Runesque, you would have a monstrous creature at the top of a mountain. <laughs> you can't touch the ground, it's so sweet. <laughs> You're gonna have to jump off. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. All right, so I'm gonna give it a six. I'm going to give it a six, too. Sounds like a good number. A meninities. A meninities. There's toilets over there, and showers. And showers. Let's go check out the condition of the showers because I'm just up there. Okay, we'll see you at the showers. Unfortunately, they have locked the toilets and the showers, as you can see, so we're unable to judge that. I feel that the fact that they're that locked should take, ba- take away from it, yes. Yes, so I'm going to say a three. I was going to say a four, so let's say a 3.5. Okay, 3.5 and a six. Of course, that's not really the important thing. We need to know how it fares in our great equaliser. It's the likelihood of finding some buried treasure here. Hmm. I mean, it's lots of open space. Yes. Um, been here for years. The races have been in. Um, you know, for years and years, with all kinds of junk that's probably been buried, probably been re dug up. So I would say, actually, hesitantly, it's probably quite likely that you would find some I would, kind of treasure. I would give it a seven. And there is like a pergola thing over there. I, I think that would be a good place to start if I was going to start digging for treasure. So I'm actually going to say an eight, so which seven, is quite 7.5. 7.5 plus. On top of 9.5. Yeah. So we're looking at a square 17. Yes. 17 out of 30. You know, it's that, a it pass. could be worse. It's a it pass. It could be worse. So, well done, Panorama. You have bested some of the other parks in town. Yes. They're not at the top. Back down the mountain. Ladies and gentlemen, I believe we have strayed into dangerous territory. Hi, I'm climbing in the net. I'm not sure I'll be able to get back down. <laughs> You're fat. Oh, <laughs> they couldn't be grammatically correct about it, really? No, no they couldn't. It's <laughs> Bathurst girls. <laughs> War- warriors. Oh, Cunts brawl with... Us for the king's pussies, <laughs> motherfuckers. Let's go from the warriors and someone's hand just 
Yeah, on this side too. <laughs> just, just so you know, these are my hands. <laughs> Sarah loves Isaiah. 2012. Totes, bitch. Go suck yourself. <laughs> This is adding some ethnic... Natasha is a slut. This is adding some eth ethnic slang. <laughs> <Ethnic. laughs> Cunt, slut, lol, whore, granny liquor. <laughs> You know, Granny Lika. I think, come slide with me. Oh, come slide with me. Let's slide, let's slide along. Is gay. <laughs> <laughs> I will kill you all by myself, Nanny Lickers from Mali. <laughs> so, let's review the park in Kelso. It's, it's a very, it's a magical place. It's a magical place. Mm. I have learnt more about the population of Kelso in this one little experience than I have in my entire life. They're well educated, distinguished, very loving, um, obviously lots of strong grasp, relationships. Um, yeah. Um, very yeah. good at tracing their hands. <laughs> really good at tracing hands. Very, oh wow. Amazing um, artists uh, and, and, and very respectful. <laughs> So um okay Penny I mean let's let's be honest parkiness. now parkiness general parkiness I like it it's not it's not as it's, it's attractive homey. it's homey yeah it really it represents Kelso in a very honest manner I feel a bit it has a unsafe. grassy knoll for, for no particular reason I feel a bit reason. unsafe being here mm. and I feel like if we linger we'll be murdered by some gang so I mean that that's got to come mm, out of the yes. points so general um, parkiness I'm gonna say. A six. I'm gonna say a five. Okay, so five and a half for general yeah. parkiness. Uh, the amenities and the utilities and the facilities. There's, there's chairs. There's chairs. There's some fence. Some fence. Couldn't have a dinosaur here because there is not all mm, fence. Yeah, I thought it was going to be a good dinosaur rearing area, but with missing fence bits, that's just mm, not. That's not very safe. There's no bins, no toilets. I'm gonna have to go. Probably no single people this. because it kind of looks like most of them are in committed relationships. Yeah, with lots several, of committed relationships. Several other people. So, I mean, where does that leave us, Penny? Um, three. Mm, I was gonna go two. So, what are you settling on? Yeah. Okay, we'll go two. So that's a two, two. from us for the Fudnivus facilities. And, 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 and what was it? for the first one. I don't know. The camera knows. <laughs> Lucky. Which brings us, of course, to the critical moment. I'm going to pass that over to Benny. Because none of that matters. It's, it's all Doesn't. white noise. No. Really, it comes Doesn't. down to Doesn't what matter. we're about to judge it on. It's the second last park of the evening. And we have this standard. So, I mean, it, it all comes down to this. Could be a complete... <laughs> Ding! Oh, dear. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to judge this park on a scale of 1 to 10 about how safe we would feel here at night. <laughs> Zero. Zero. I'm going to be a bit more honest. I, I mean, we're surrounded by houses. We don't know who lives in them, but I'm, I'm going to say two. We know that Kelso people live in them. Yeah, uh, yeah. And we know it's, this, <laughs> it's a gang territory, so um, I'm going to say two. Okay, so it equals out at one. One. One for the bonus, so yeah. it's not a game changer. So we don't know our previous scores, but you do. So yeah. you can do the maths on do this the, one. Do the maths. I'm getting the idea. Send it into us. I'm getting the idea. It's probably under ten. Send it. Send an email to the email we gave you from that other park. Forward it on to that. Yes, Jesse sixteen at hotmail dot com. <laughs> She'd love. She's standing by to hear from <laughs> Remember, me. it's not Jesse with or a he. Y. It's she Jesse with he. an I. She J E S S I sixteen by for that. or L six. <laughs> At hotmail.com. Now, now, what we've, Let her neglected, know, what we've know. neglected to mention, what I, don't know, I don't know if it's been clear up until now, um, but we're actually sat on the top of a pretty awesome jewel slide. And I think, you know, the perfect way to send off this place is to go down arm in arm. Ready? And... I'm so going to get stuck and you're <laughs> going to have your arm wrenched off. Ready? <laughs> Set. Shit! <yeah! laughs> don't land in the puddles. <laughs>